there are at least 56 million kilometers standing between us and Mars. That's a long way to travel. But what if there was something that could help? An untapped force all around us that could give us an extra push. I'm Ren Schmidt, and we're exploring the science behind For All Mankind. With the journey to Mars heating up between NASA, Helios, and the Soviet Union, we wanted to create a thrilling come-from-behind surprise. What could give someone an unexpected edge in this literal space race? The answer led us into the light. Light is made up of photons. Photons don't have any mass, but they do have momentum. A single photon soaring through space can't do much. But the sun pumps out trillions of photons per second. And all these photons in zero gravity, well, they can pack a punch. So, how can we harness them? We need something large and reflective, something that can bounce light. A solar sail made of mylar can do just that. The photons bounce off the reflective sail, transferring their momentum, pushing the ship forward. More photons means more momentum. The impact may be small, but it's steady. It's a little boost that can really add up. To push a ship as big as NASA's Sojourner, you'd need a really big sail. Making a sail that big would be challenging, and the bigger the sail, the more fuel you'd need to launch. But a ship with a large enough sail could ride the sunlight all the way to Mars. Riding photons through space may sound like fiction, but it's science. Scientists are currently exploring how the use of lasers and thinner, lighter materials could open up new possibilities. Even now, there's a toaster-sized spacecraft orbiting the Earth by solar sail. While solar sails that could propel a ship as massive as Sojourner aren't reality just yet, a future of space exploration fueled by the sun is certainly a powerful idea. <laughs>